Divorce. My favorite topic, or least favorite topic, depending on how you look at it. Uh, but first, let's talk about life after divorce, because that's something that most people who are going through a divorce are thinking about. Thinking about having a life after divorce, or thinking about how your life will be after divorce, are common because people tend to fear for themselves. There's an old joke. Why are divorces so expensive? Answer, because they're worth it. But humor can only offer so little comfort to the reality of life after divorce. Sure, you are bound to somebody through the mere fact that you woke up next to a body, for an elongated duration of time, but the truth is that life after divorce may be the first time that you experience independence, actually for the first time in quite a while, which is a scary thought to very many people. Here are five things to keep in mind, put your mind at ease when it comes to life after divorce. Picture yourself in your life after divorce. Where do you want to be? Where are you going to end up? These are often the questions that people don't think about when going through a divorce. By envisioning your life after divorce, you can take the first steps towards emotional stability and conquer the life after divorce. No, it won't be easy once you have thought things through. Emotions always get in the way, especially if you are going through a divorce. However, you are not alone in the world, just like how many people will get yelled at by their boss at work today, or how many people will experience car trouble today. Many people have to adjust to a life after divorce, just like they have to adjust to those other things. Those who have faced such an ordeal will tell you that the best possible strategy for adjusting to a life after divorce is to face this moment head on. Acknowledging where you are in your life will ensure a positive life after divorce. Remember that sense of freedom the first time you were dropped off at college or got your very first car? Long time ago for me. The good news is that a life after divorce could present another fresh start for you. Unlike those moments though, you went through a rough patch to earn this moment. But you should look at yourself as the phoenix rising through the ashes, this time blessed with knowledge that so many of us wish we had before going through a rough ordeal or having done that before you got married. Life after divorce is not an end, it is a new beginning. Many people don't make it in this world. Most of the time that can be attributed to the company that they keep. To experience a positive life after divorce, surround yourself with positive influences. Much like how life after divorce can present a fresh start, a life after divorce allow, can allow you to cultivate new relationships, whether these be friendly, professional, romantic. Each new relationship is a new journey, and you should look for the best qualities in people. Again, this is probably easier said than done. A lot of the time, people feel lonely after a divorce. But not unlike the solution in item one, you have to be logical and forward thinking in your newfound relationships. Do not settle for the person who offers the first quick fix in a life after divorce. Remember, you were smart before you got married, you're still smart in your life after divorce. Do not sell yourself short. Surround yourself with people you like in your free time. Like everything in life, how you cope with life, life after divorce boils down to one ingredient. You, not that the shackles of marriage have been removed, don't be afraid to indulge a little in your life after divorce. You can indulge in things you used to love, playing squash, going on road trips, starting that blog you always wanted to, or even better, pick up a new hobby. Hey, remember! Cooking class you always wanted to take? Then you once really want to try musical theater? Who doesn't want to learn a new language? Now that you have a life after divorce, start living after divorce. Keep in mind, there are, will be responsibilities in your life still, but once in a while, it's okay to stop and smell the roses, even if you don't get divorced. Many people do not know how to handle 
themselves in their life after divorce. Rest assured that some part of that has to do with a lack of preparation. A life after divorce is a life after divorce, and nobody walks this earth without a plan. Why should divorce be any different? It's not. Much like in item one, think about the life you want after a divorce. Think about what you're moving on to and plan accordingly. Set minor goals for yourself, whether they are goals for your newfound hobby, goals of finding a place that will fit you or your family, or even a goal of resting at night and watching TV. Organization is the key to life after the divorce. Life after divorce really comes down to your actions. Socrates once compared emotion to a two-headed beast residing in everyone's soul. Divorce is an emotional time. There is no shame in feeling that emotion. However, you can combat the two-headed beast with simple logic, which comes with planning, visualization, preparation for the road ahead. Life is a continuous journey, and divorce will be just a bump in the road. But if you know where the road is heading, bumps are only very minor issues to your destination. So, were these tips helpful or what? These are the kinds of videos that we're going to be doing in the future. Maybe once a week, maybe twice a week, maybe five times a week, maybe 15 times a week. Who knows? I like being in front of the camera, as you can tell. We want you to subscribe below to our YouTube channel. And you can follow us on our social media links right below. Start right now. We want you to know that here at Michael Howard Wolf Law Firm, and especially me. We are always on your side.